Hi, welcome back. It's Justin Pasqua at I Love Banville. Last week we were at the Porsche car show at the livery. This week we're at the Ferrari car show at the livery. Take a look at this, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah, hey, I'm Rob, and obviously you met me before. I had a car show here at the paddock for the Porsches. Well, today we invited in the Ferraris, and we have over 40 Ferraris here, and uh, the whole thing is put together to benefit a charity. That's the Juvenile Diabetic Research Foundation, and everybody here that's displayed their car graciously donated money to the charity, and we're having a great day. Got blessed with sunny weather. We got uh, also in this uh, car show, I took it a, a step, step up, and we did a food wine sampling tour. We're also having a fashion show, and if weather permits, we're going to try to do a detailed demonstration. But it is kind of hot. Black cars and heat don't really mix, so we might not be able to get that in. But I try to create more of an event to have a fun time, and uh, we're out enjoying the day. So take your camera, walk around, and look at the different cars. Well, I'm Frank Espina. I'm a CPA. I've had Ferraris for about, this is my second Ferrari. I had one, my first one was a, a Mondial Cabriolet, which I purchased oh, about uh, eight, nine years ago, and I had it until uh, about two years ago, and I sold it, and I bought the Testarossa. What kind of Ferrari is this? It's 430 Scuderia. Uh, 2009, and they're probably going to make about maybe 200 of them. I'm not sure the number, but close to 200. And this is really fast. This is uh, got the pedal shifts and uh, carbon fiber uh, door panels inside. It's, uh, red stitching, uh, beautiful. This thing is uh, this thing is fast. I mean, super fast. <laughs> uh, I'm not used to the pedal shifts, but uh, takes a while. But uh, I'm, I really, I really love it. I really enjoy this car. I have two more Ferraris, but this is the best one so far. Hope you're enjoying the show. And I'm giving it over to Jim. Okay. Hey, I'm from Yumi Go Indoor Car Racing, Livermore, California, and uh, we're about motorsports for the regular guy. You come over to our place. We have everything you need to have fun. And basically, you get in the car like this one here, and you go about 45 mile an hour on the quarter mile track. We have 20 variations. No one in the country is doing that. And we make it all about fun and making sure that you actually have a great time on the track and go fast as you can, and we'll teach you how to go fast. So come on down and enjoy it, and we'll show you a good time. Hey, Jim, how fast do these cars go, bud? 45. 45 inside. And you'll never believe how fast that feels when you're going that fast that far. Some last-minute additions. Some last-minute additions. Some last-minute Welcome back. But I love Danville. Justin Pasco, your host. You never know who you meet here at the Danville Car Show. I have a couple guests I'd like you to meet. Bruce? Bruce? Kevin? Kevin? And they're beautiful. 430 Ferrari. Amazing. Amazing car. I'd love to ask you a few questions sure. about How much horsepower are we working with? Uh, this is 490, I believe. So How it's many? Stock 430. So. Well, so what do I have to do to get involved in this club? I'd love to drive one. You can, you can join one. You can join the club. You don't have to own a car. Come down. And it is incredibly quick. You know, double clutches, downshifts. I mean, it is blazingly fast. Okay. So I have seen a helmet that you have over here on the right side of the car. Yeah, sure. Okay. Hey, do you wear that? Wait, on the the road? No, no, no. That's, that, that's, I'm going to I'm going to the track literally from here down to the racetrack. Oh, amazing! Uh, so right uh, uh, so uh, this is what I call my three-car helmet. I own three Ferraris. Uh, this blue one here, which was bought with iPod stock, as I call it. Uh, so this is the 430 blue car. This is the yellow car, which is, was bought with uh, Next stock. I was employing 95 there, so that's this side. And my oldest Ferrari is a 308. And it was bought with Mipstock and an employee 15 there. So this is my, my current helmet, which I run, which is modeled after a 99 Schumacher helmet from, from Ferrari when he was winning all the time. So, but, uh... 
Hi, this is Rob again, and uh, I'm standing next to Mike Ponte. He's, Hi, how are you? He's a good friend of mine, and what he does, he helps me out a lot. We started playing this Ferrari car show about four months ago, and uh, I had a lot of individual owners come in, but a big part of it was the Ferrari Owners Club of America, and it was the Pacific region. And when I put the call out that I need some cars, they rallied together and got us, uh, you know, about 40 Ferraris here for today's uh, uh, display. And I'd like to introduce Mike Ponte, and he has a few words to say about the Ferrari Club. And, the, you know, this is just a good example of what the Ferrari Club, uh, these are the kind of events that we like to do. Most of the uh, events we do are for charity. We, uh, when Rob approached me uh, he wanted to plan this event, I immediately said, uh, absolutely, indeed, we wanted to do it and help, help this organization. And uh, this is just another example of the type of events that the Ferrari Club does. It's a great organization. Uh, of course, we're, we're very enthusiastic about our cars, but we also do a lot of good social events, too. So I would encourage anyone that has a Ferrari, even if you don't have a Ferrari, you can still join the, uh, the Ferrari Club of America and uh, join us in having a really good time and, uh, and having, fun, having fun with the car culture. So. Well, and today we uh, I organized this whole event along with Mike to benefit something that's very dear to me. Uh, it's the Juvenile Diabetic Research Foundation because my son was diagnosed at four years old. And through uh, research and development, he's now 18, had it for 14 years. He, uh, it was a struggle when he first got it, but through uh, advances in medicine, he's leading a pretty normal life. And he's on his way to college, so I don't have to worry about him as much. And the only way this happens is that we uh, give money to the Juvenile Diabetic Research Foundation. And I'd like to introduce, this is Luis Gonzalez. He has uh, helped me organize the uh, JDR side of the show, and I'd like for him to say a few words about the uh, game. Perfect. Well, first of all, I'd like to thank Rob for putting this on. Uh, awesome guy. This is a great event. I'm with Juvenile Diabetes Research Foundation. Our goal is to get money to fund research to find a cure for diabetes. As Rob already mentioned, he's touched by diabetes, as his son has it. I'm sure many people out there know someone with diabetes. We're, our main thrust is finding a cure, funding research to find that cure and that's why we're here today all the proceeds today go to that I'd like to that one feels colder okay okay, okay. thank you and then you know you can see that little bead there you just pull that off you want me to pull this uh this sure. this uh here we are, entertaining one of our valuable customers and a, a neighbor. Are you from my uh, elbow here or Daniel? How long have you been a, uh, a resident? Probably longer than you. Probably longer than I've been alive, I'm hoping you can say. <laughs> there you go. Okay. Have some, and, and listen, we can get a real candid first. Have you ever tried most of them before? No. Well, try it. Okay. We got you on camera here, so oh now you have to be nice. But go ahead. Okay. I'm. I trust okay. you. It'll be okay. <laughs> Pretty good, right? Surprising. It's good. Have a nice, healthy Surprising. day. Surprising. Okay, thanks. Right. Cool. All right. You never know. <laughs> Thank you very much, Rob. Well, thanks a lot for coming out, guys. And uh, go to I Love Danville TV. And if you want to see the show and you uh, want to come to one of our future events, go to thepaddockatdelivery.com. Subscribe to our email list. That's the only way to find out about these shows. We do advertise, but that's the best, best way to contact uh, on these different shows we produce. Behind me, we have the Enzo Ferrari. It's a very rare and limited car. It's about a race car for the street. And if you want to come around and you can take a look inside, take a quick video. It's a complete carbon fiber monocoque. An amazing piece. Doesn't even look driving. <laughs> you, should, you should sell them while seeing the you? I don't know. Again, you know what? We're going to finish off with the Enzo because you can't really top that for a Ferrari Exotic. So thanks a lot for coming out today. And uh, we'll see you again.